find the probability of flipping exactly two heads on three coins. So, so to figure out this probability, a good place to start is just to think about all of the different possible ways that we can flip three coins. So we could get, we could get all tails, 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 tails. We could get tails, tails, heads. We could get tails, heads, tails. We could get tails, heads, heads. We could get heads, tails, tails. We could get heads, tails, heads. We could get heads, heads, tails. And then we could get all heads. And we could get all heads over here. So they are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight possible outcomes. Eight possible outcomes, outcomes. Now, how many of the outcomes involve flipping exactly Exactly two heads. Let's see, that's all tails. That's one head, one head. This has two heads right there. Two heads. That's one head. This is two heads right over there. Then this is two heads right over here. And then this is three heads, so that doesn't count. So there are three, three outcomes, three outcomes where we, with exactly, with exactly, 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 Two heads. So let me spell heads properly. Two heads. So the probability, the probability of flipping of exactly, exactly two heads, and the word exactly is important because if you didn't say exactly, then maybe three heads, well you flip two heads, so you have to say exactly two heads, so you don't so you, you don't include the uh, the situation where you get three heads. So the probability of it flipping exactly two heads is equal to the three outcomes with two heads divided by the eight possible outcomes, or three eighths. So it is equal to three eighths. And we are done.